Welcome to the Sumo Logic Secure Demo. We've recently built an application in the cloud and we're concerned with securing our application, monitoring both the infrastructure and the application logs from a variety of different angles. We're going to use Sumo Logic to not only monitor these types of issues, but figure out when we have particular problems we should investigate and we're going to investigate a security problem within our environment. We're monitoring a variety of different components on our systems overview dashboard. We're taking a look at storage, compute, load balancing, web application logs, and we're understanding uh, key performance indicators across the environment. We've also set up an alert to inform us when one of these key performance indicators goes outside of the zone of normal here. We've configured a webhook alert to send to Slack and it looks like we've been notified that our S3 audit logs have an abnormal number of errors in them and we'd like to use this to dive back into Sumo Logic and investigate the appropriate dashboard. In this case we've built an S3 dashboard specifically for the investigation of S3 audit logs. It looks like this dashboard is telling us that we have a spike in 403 errors. As a security professional I should know what 403 errors are but I'd like the dashboard to remind me uh, what these error codes mean. It looks like they mean invalid access key ID or access denied. My suspicion is that the access denied is that somebody has a particular password problem. However, my suspicion with the large number of invalid access key ID messages is that perhaps someone has compromised our environment. And what I'd like to do is actually dive into the logs and investigate this scenario. I can loop from the dashboards right into search here and understand in depth the search that is generating this table of information. I know that my problem was somewhere around 627, so I'm going to focus on that particular area and dive into the raw log messages. In this case, these are going to be the S3 audit logs. From here, I'm interested in investigating not only the S3 audit logs, but all of the logs in my entire stack associated with my particular application. I'd like to focus in on a two minute time period and see if I can find the root cause of this problem. There are many results here, looks like a little over 1700, and I'm not sure what keywords to search for to find the root cause. We've developed a pattern matching algorithm known as log reduce that helps you really filter out some of the noise and focus on the unique events in your environment. The events that only happened one time. So we can get a little deeper handle on what is going on with the unique events in your environment. I see that this event only happened once, so I'd like to take a little bit closer look at that and figure out what's going on here. It looks like it is a particular user named Samuel who's performing an event name operation of update access key around that same time period. This could be quite problematic. The source of this information is from CloudTrail to let me know who's accessing my cloud infrastructure. We've also developed a dashboard around CloudTrail. Sumo Logic has several analytics that come out of the box, CloudTrail being one of these, where we can get a further investigative view into that particular user. Now remember from the log message, the user's name is Samuel. And I'd like to understand where Samuel is coming from. I don't believe we have any employees from that area of the world. And there are also some details uh, reading from the bottom up here on what's going on with Samuel. It looks like the Samuel login was actually created by a user named John. So I am suspicious that John's credentials could have been compromised in this particular scenario. So let's dive in a little bit deeper and filter this dashboard specifically on the user John. And what we're seeing is that John is attempting to access and successfully accessing our Amazon Web Services infrastructure from two locations in the world in 20 minutes. This either means that he's uh, routing his traffic in a peculiar way or that his credentials have been compromised. At this point, I'll talk to John and get his credentials changed and resolve the situation. I've now used Sumo Logic to be notified of an issue, dive in and figure out the root cause and report back to my team so I can resolve the issue. Thank you for tuning in.